Hi everyone, in this video we are going to solve simultaneous equations by eliminating a variable. So here we have 6x plus 5y equals to 62 and 4x minus 5y equals to 8. So we are going to add these two equations to eliminate y. So here we have 6x plus 4x that will give you 10x and plus 5y minus 5y gets cancelled that's equal to 0 so we have equals to 62 plus 8 that gets 70 so here we have x is equal to 70 divided by 10 that is 7 so x is equal to 7 so now how to find the other variable y you just substitute the value of x in one of the equations either of them because they're going to give you the same answer so let's substitute in this 6x plus 5y equals to 62. So you have 6 times 7 plus 5y equals to 62. 6 times 7 is 42. So we have 5y equals to, you bring 42 the other side, it becomes negative 62 minus 42. So we have 5y equals to 20. So y is equal to 20 divided by 5, that is equal to 4. This is how you find the values of x and y. Let's see another example. 4x plus 2y equals to 50 <clears throat> and x plus 2y equals to 20. So what are we going to do here? We are going to subtract the equation to eliminate one variable. So that will be, now when you're going to subtract, like, 4x minus x will give you 3x. 2y minus 2y becomes minus. Change the signs. Minus 2y, it's cancelled. So you have 3x equals to 50 minus 20. That's equal to 30. <clears throat> so here we have x is equal to 30 divided by 3. That's equal to 10. Now let's substitute the x value in one of the equations, this one, 6 plus 2y, any, you can choose any, x plus 2y equals to 20, so let's substitute 10, so you have 10 plus 2y equals to 20, then 2y equals to 20 minus 10, when it goes the other side of equal to, it becomes negative, so 2y equals to 10, so y is equal to 10 divided by 2, that's 5. Because 2 times 5 gives 10, so y is equal to 5. Alright, let's see another example. <clears throat> For example, if you have this 2x plus 3y equals to 13 and this. Now here, what are we going to do? You have uh, you have something different here. Like you, you don't have 8 equal to this side. So let's bring 8 equal to this side all right the other side of equal to so it becomes 2x minus 4y equals to negative 8 when it goes the other side now the two equations look similar so let's strike off this one now we have this equation and this equation similar to each other what are we going to do to eliminate we can eliminate 2x by subtracting the equations yes so let's subtract <clears throat> plus 2x minus 2x will get cancelled and here minus into minus this will become plus if i have a minus and minus it will become plus 3 plus 4y will give you 7y and here 13 minus of minus will become plus so 13 plus 8 so you have to add here add here 13 plus 8 is 21 so y is equal to 21 divided by 7 is 3. Now let's see, find out x value. So substitute on this 2x plus 3y equals to 13. So 2x plus 3 multiplied by 3, that's 9 is equal to 13. So 2x is equal to bring 9 this side, it becomes negative. 13 minus 9. x is equal to 13 minus 9 is 4 divided by 2, which is equal to 2. So x is equal to 2.